How many of you know what these gentlemen over here are? Anybody? This young, this young lady. I've seen some of them play. I don't know if I'd call them golfers. I'm just teasing. No, no, no. Now, let me, let, me, let me explain the difference, okay? Now, the people that you see on TV, like Tiger Woods and Phil Mickelson and um, you know, Sergio Garcia, no, those, those, are, those are PGA Tour players. Those are, those are guys that, those guys play golf for a living. These gentlemen over here with some of our volunteers, we have a young lady from the first tee that helps teach. But pretty much the majority of these gentlemen are PGA golf professionals, and they are the people that live in towns like in Denver and around the area. And what they do is they teach golf for a living. So basically, they would be your coach today. They're going to coach you and help you play golf. So who, who like told me that? Did somebody tell me that? Nobody told me that. One. Got it right. Y'all got it right. What, what, what you need to do? Okay. Next time, I'm looking for the first hand to go up. Don't say the answer. Now I'm going to change the question. Okay. Don't say the answer. So put your hands down. Put your hands down. Okay. Everybody ready? Who's the governor of Colorado? Bill Ritter, there you go. Perfect. How many of you have ever been to a golf tournament? Anybody ever been to a golf tournament? You're like, where, what golf tournament you go to? Been to one here? Where, here, like at this field? Okay. That, that wouldn't be a... Um, a PGA Tour event. There might have been a tournament out here, but next next May we're actually going to host the Senior PGA Champ. Okay, that you're listening to your coach, then you have an opportunity to get a hat for your group because I'm going to give each one of the coaches a hat. So they're all going to have a hat to start with. So at the end of the session, they're going to pick one person out of your group who was by far paid more attention and listened the best. It's something. My whole purpose of introducing this person for you is, hey, at one time he sat on a hill just like you, had some ideas, studied hard, kind of made good grades in school, really and ended up inventing okay. a product that's really kind of helped revolutionize uh, the game of golf and how we bring it to youngsters. So this is a friend of mine. This is Mr. John Breaker. He invented birdie ball. How about a round of applause for John? So pretty, pretty neat stuff. And then this gentleman back here filming everything. That's John's partner, Mr. Paul Olson with Birdie Ball. So thanks to John and Paul for having us out today. Okay. So with basically the first thing we're going to do is we're going to teach you how to grip the golf club. We're going to do a little show and tell this morning. So how many of you, if you throw, you throw the ball with your right hand, okay, you're right-handed, what you're going to do, think about this, okay, you're going to grab the golf club in your left hand, and your left hand is high, okay? This is high up on the grip. Your right hand is going to be low on the grip, okay? low. Right hand high, left hand low, okay? Everybody got that? Okay, now, Delaney, you want to come up here? You're going to see, can you grip that? Actually, I'll let you grip that. It might be a little warm. It'll cool off in just a second. Okay, come on over here, Delaney. Now, oh, excuse me, what sorry. we have here is a board. It's called sure. the strike pad. Do you see what this, there's a letter B on it. What do you think the B stands for? Anybody? Ball. Ball, okay. That's where we're going to put the ball. What did I do with the ball? <laughs> okay, so. 
The B is where you put the ball. It goes right there on the pad. Okay, Delaney, grip the club, left hand low, or left hand high, right hand low. Now, look at her, your feet. Put the B right in between your feet, right in the middle of your feet. Okay, not, don't stand on the pad. Just kind of mirror me, okay, like this. There you go, all right? And then the B's right in the middle. Your shoulders, okay, are square to the pad, and your feet are right underneath your shoulders. So that means... Do you think my feet are underneath my shoulders right now if I did it this wide? No, just slightly open like that, okay? Now, when you take the club back, you see this part of the club? Anybody know? Raise your hand. Don't yell it out. I have a t-shirt for you. You don't put your hands down first. Let me ask the question. What's this part of the golf club? The nose? The nose? Nope. The head? The head? I'm, I'm looking for a specific part of the head of the golf club. face. Not the face. The edge up there in the white. The what? <coughs> okay, so remember, does anybody, somebody holler it out if you know it? Okay, all right, I didn't hear it. It's called the toe of the golf club. Okay? It's called the toe of the golf club. So when you take the club back, okay, ready, Delaney? When you take the club back, you're going to point the toe of the golf club straight up into the air, okay? All right, and then when you swing through, I want you to clip the board, okay? Swing all the way through, and then the toe of the golf club is pointing up in the air again. Everybody see that? Yeah. So when you take the club back, the toe is up. When you swing the club through, you clip the board, the toe is up in the air. Now with your arms, okay, you see some, some everybody knows what spaghetti's like before it's cooked? Yeah. You know how stiff spaghetti is? Yeah. It's just rigid. Okay, I want you to imagine your arms are trying to cook spaghetti. So don't keep them real stiff like this. Keep them loose like cooked spaghetti. So the toe goes up and the toe up. Everybody see that? So it's here when you take it back, the toe's up in the air, pointing to the sky, you clip the board and go up. Okay, so look at, do you drink root beer? So do you have a root beer belly? You don't have a belly, I have a belly. But you want to make sure your belly's pointing at the B, the ball's on the B, and then toe up to toe up and clip the board. Can you do that for us? You ready? What, this doesn't fly? Yep, it'll fly, watch. Okay, you ready? Go ahead, toe up, here. Get down into it. There you go. Okay, let's do it one more time. Now we want to do it nice and gentle to start out with. Okay? All right, do it again. Okay, toe up to toe up. There you go. We're getting there. And one last thing. Okay? So, ready? Okay, you ready? Watch. Toe up, flip the board, gets up in the air. All right, how about a round of applause for Delaney? Okay, it's really pretty simple. Okay, the B, the ball's on the B. My belly's pointing at the B. The B's in the middle of my stance. Okay, in between my legs. My feet are underneath my shoulders. I'm going to take the club back. My toe's going to be up in the air when I go back. I'm going to clip the board. My toe's going to be up. Watch how easy this is. I didn't even swing very hard. Okay, so it's pretty easy. You guys ready to try that? Yeah! I'm not sure you guys are ready to try that. Are you guys ready to try that? Okay.